Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome to the Cruster, bringing you a video about, well, the title's basically self explanatory. Morgan Lewis, I saw your article in 4G about The Last of Us. I got a lot to say to you, man, and yo, we got to talk, so hopefully, you see my video and you can comment. Um, first off, a lot of things you said, yo, I agree with you, I agree with you, but you know what? There's a lot I got to say about it. Um, look. The way I see it as, you say The Last of Us is not a great game, but it seems like you give more pros than cons about the game, which I find very funny. One of the things that shocked me about what you said is they don't deserve the over over 240 Game of the Year uh, award. You know what? If somebody didn't deserve anything that he should have never got in the first place, I'm pretty sure you know what I'm getting at when I say that. Basically, if they didn't deserve it, they would have never got it. That's how I look at it, dude. I'm not trying to be a smart ass. I'm not trying to do none of that. It's just, you know, like if someone doesn't deserve anything, or especially an award given by higher ranking, well, not higher ranking, but, you know, people that did it and judges that I'm pretty sure that are very well experienced with video games for the past years, I'm pretty sure they would not give them the awards for nothing. Um, another thing I gotta say to you is, listen, you said the, okay, one thing's off of your article, you said something pretty basic, you said that the fact that when you throw a material like a glass bottle, uh, a, a brick or whatever to distract a zombie or a person or a, uh, a guy that's standing by for uh, a guard, you're saying when they look, you know, they look at the throwing object, you're saying that's a uh, pretty basic. I mean, I, I was like, wait, what are you trying to get at? You know, what point are you making? Like, I'm pretty sure if you heard something being thrown, you look in the same direction that it got thrown at. So, how was that basic? I think that's basically just human nature, man. I mean, you got you to gotta know what's being thrown, right? I mean, what else are you going to do to distract them? I mean, and then you go into stealth. Now, let me get on something I did agree about what you said. When you were like, uh... When you go behind, you know, going behind, like, let me see, can I, okay, never mind, all right, yeah, going behind uh, chairs, tables, it kind of messes up, because, you know, one time I went behind a chair, uh, I mean, not a chair, a table, and the guy saw me, and that's probably, that's probably like a little bug they need to fix, but like, yeah, I went behind a table one time before, and uh, they still saw me, and, you know, I was like, how did they see me? I thought, like, when you crouch, you're in stealth mode, and when you're behind something, they can't see you. Who knows? But, you know, I think The Last of Us is a great game. Um, you say that everything else is nice, the graphics, the storyline, the music, it's all beautiful and stuff, quote-unquote what you said. Um, but you say it lacks the gameplay. Um... When you're in, like, a zombie apocalypse, zom you know, when you're playing a game that's zombie apocalypse, I think, what more do you want? Uh, what do you want to, you want superpowers? Like, I mean, I'm pretty sure when you play a game like that, it's going to be pretty basic, right? I mean, unless you're playing, like, Dying Light or, uh, what do you call it, uh, Dead Rising? Because you can, like, uh, enhance your weapons crafted all that good stuff i mean of course i mean but you know the last of us they tell a story like you said they tell a, they tell a nice story and what what how basic like how more advanced do you want it to be like to be honest overall i think you're asking for too much you know and i'm not trying to start bad blood between us but you know i'm just giving my opinion like you gave yours i think the last of us is a great game and you know what before i keep moving on my game real quick hold on i want to get at what you said at the end you said, quote unquote, because I'm reading it. You said, the music is wonderful, the presentation is extraordinary, and the story and the characters are superb, but the gameplay experience leaves a lot to be desired. It is definitely not the kind of game, in my opinion, worthy of over 240 Game of the Year awards. Nevertheless, though, this brings us back to a fundamental question, especially in this day and age. What defines a great video game? And is the cinematic factor becoming more important than the gaming factor? What should be, what should the balance be? This is an incredibly important question for the gaming industry, well, for the game industry moving forward. Now, when you said that last part, I thought to myself, he's absolutely right. And then I thought to myself, I started, I started uh, scrolling back. I started scrolling back. I'm thinking, 
Well, now that he says that at the end of the video, I mean the video, not the video. I mean the end of your article. Now that you say that at the end of the article, then what's the point of you saying that's not a great game? Uh, I mean, like I said, I know it's your opinion. I know, I know it's what you think. But when it all comes down to it, if you just if you just point that out at the end, of course. I mean, there's a lot of games that I consider not the best. Uh, I'm pretty sure everything you're thinking about, the gaming industry has already thought about why is not, why is this not in there? Why can't we do this? Why can't we do that? I'm pretty sure everything you're thinking about, they already thought about. And maybe they have their reasons. Who knows uh, how to make the game? But um, that's how I feel about it. Uh, it's just, I love The Last of Us. I love that game. <laughs> I really did. That's why I, if someone wasn't going to reply to you, I had to do it. I had to do it. And like I said before, I ain't trying to start nothing between us, no bad blood. I actually want you to comment on the video. I actually want you to see this video so you can tell me what you think. And also, my viewers, whoever's looking at this, you know, put your comments down too. Tell me about what you guys think about The Last of Us and how Naughty Dog did. And another, one last thing, because I know I don't want to make this video too long. One last thing that you said in this article that also tricked me is... You said that it doesn't have the right, not the have the right, but it doesn't deserve to be called a survival horror game because nothing scary, uh, nothing really mind blowing scary happened in this game. Now, here's where I think that you can't, you can't really do. I'm gonna say you can't do that. Yes, I'm gonna say you can't do that. The Evil Within, Outlast. PT that was on that was on the PS4 PT. I had a lot of friends that told me that played that game and said that game, those games weren't scary. I looked at them like they was crazy because I was like, that game didn't scare y'all. I was scared out of my mind when I played uh, Outlast. I still haven't finished that game because I'm that scared. Like I will not finish the last of us. I will not finish it for nothing. I still got walkthroughs to finish on my channel. I will not finish Outlast. I'm too freaking scared. That that's why I said, well, what what makes you? If you say it doesn't need to be called a survival horror, or, <laughs> oh my god, I'm messing up. It doesn't need to be called a survival horror game. Well, why would you say that? I mean. You are surviving, right? Well, the, let's look at the first part. Survival horror. You are surviving. I'm pretty sure everyone knows that. It's a zombie apocalyptic game. You are surviving. To find out, I guess, like you said, a cure. You are surviving. I know I said that a lot. Um, And horror. Zombies go under the category horror. I mean, what what do you think they are? I mean, they're they're ugly as I don't know what, but and they're they're... They're dead people with a bad, bad virus. Uh, uh, it's kind of horror. Survival horror. Makes sense to me. But I guess it didn't make sense to you. But, you know, this is the cross that I'm out. Morgan, see this video. If you don't have a YouTube channel, make one. I mean, Google Plus. I mean, whatever. Comment on this video. You know, me and you can go back and forth at this. I would really enjoy it. Like I said, no bad blood between us. I just... You know, I just wanted to give uh, my feedback to what you said, and maybe you can have someone to talk to about The Last of Us. But, alright, I'm out. Eesh.